These sweets are driving me insane. Shush, the sweets. Anyway. <laughs> Great way to start the video. Hello. Oh, Gary C. Today you join me showing off wares. Wares that I bought when I was away on the Disney Fantasy for a non-vloggy holiday with my friends Adam, Alex and Max. And then a trip with my friend, um, <laughs> What is wrong with my voice today? Hello, wake up. <laughs> Leggies, wake up. Chrissy, wake up. Voice, wake up. Anyway, I went to Disney World for the October -y season with my friend Adam and I got a load of stuff. So if this is not for you, this video, then click away now because there's things, 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 capitalism, capitalism, things. Um, these I got from eBay because I think they're from a Disneyland not Disney World but yeah when I wore them in Disney World people were asking about them and my friend Alex designed this I'll put a link in the description below add mini done let's get on to the spoils girls oh anyway there's a thumbnail Woo! <laughs> we went to the Halloween party and they give you sweets as you go round now this is all just full of sweets but we also tried out for his video and um i can't stand peanut i know there's loads of people watching this that are like reese's pieces and peanut butter aficionados can't stand it can't stand the smell of it can't stand the look of it so this bag is like non-peanut and non-allergy and you get a little token and, and whatever i'll put adam's channel in the description because then you can watch the vlogs and it all makes sense but these are the two bags. These weigh a lot. So thankfully my suitcase was still under. But um, I'll just, oh, I want to pour this out to show you the types of sweets you get, but then I don't want to have to clear them up. I'm doing Oh God, that's going to take me ages. So you get a little M&Ms, Starbursts, Snickers, Almond Brownie, Almond Brownie, Normal Snickers, little mini Snickers. Part of me thinks they've got a deal with Snickers, just saying. And then what else is in there? Milky Way. Oh, I do like Milky Way. Anyway, so let's scrape that stuff to one side. That's future Gary's problem. Now let's look at the, the non-allergy stuff. So there's these bars, which are enjoy life. <laughs> enjoy life. Spend money. <laughs> enjoy life. Um, and these are wheat, peanut, tree nut, dairy, casein, soy, egg, everything dairy free it's dark chocolate though and it's really strong and i know some of my friends are watching this saying aren't you haven't you got an intolerance to co cocoa cocoa i do so here's the gummy bear things there's lollies there's these little sweets so a good little haul oh sunflower buttercups i don't know what that is this is chaotic this video already there is part of me that wants to just dump that stuff into there but it's going to be for the trick-or-treaters that knock on our front door on Halloween so and my nephew and niece will get a chunk of this stuff anyway so I can't do that because hey equal opportunities for sweets yeah I'm cleaning it up now because it's driving me insane looking at it what of it whistle while you work I can't whistle so I'm just gonna go oh there's skittles in there snacks now, I bought these because these are my favourite thing in Disney World. I have mentioned them before. They are the mini sweet graham cookies. They are very addictive. I love them. Um, and I also bought these at the airport for myself. Um, Mentos Rainbow. Now, they like the Mentos fruit, but they are... I want to say more flavoursome, but they're more artificially flavoury tasting. I, I think I gave um, a couple to Adam on the flight and he was like... But I like them. But you, I don't think you can get the rainbow ones in the UK. Moving on to things for other people. So, this stuff weighs a ton. So I, we went to a Publix, um, which is a big shopping place in America. And my friend Brogan, I've said before, loves these caramel M&Ms that you can get in America. So I got her a big bag. I got my brother a big bag. And I got my niece a big bag. Now, my sister-in-law and my nephew absolutely love 
sour Skittles, but they do, you can get them on Amazon here, but they're not as strong, they're very different. So I got them three bags of these each, because they both absolutely love them. So that's that. <laughs> then, on to the Mickey Rice Krispy thing. Now I've said before, I'm not a big fan of these myself, but, so I got two for my friend Pete, two for Brogan, Two for her fiance Benji, and two, well, one each for our friends Alex and Max. Sweet done. Let's move on to the little free souvenirs. So, as I said before, we did do Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, and you get these little maps that have got like a map of the place and all the characters and the snacks and everything else. But you also get a wristband, which is really, really cool. Um, I love that because it's a nice little keepsake. But as you're leaving, you get this print, this 50th anniversary. Mickey's Not So Scary print. And I thought that was a really nice touch because that's something you can keep or you can put in a special folder or you can put up. And it's something you can look back on because I don't think I'm going to be going to for Halloween again for a long time because I've just done it. So, yeah, that's a really nice little thing to keep and it shows that... I was there for the 50th anniversary at Halloween, so I really like that. But obviously I collected the um, the little maps, so I've got the, there's two, I didn't know there was two, I think there's two for every park. So there's Epcot, um, there's Animal Kingdom, you see that? That one is Tree of Life, that one is the Finding Nemo show, which has been updated and we saw it and we both loved it. Um, then you've got, I only got one of these, um, I don't know if there's two for these, there must be, so Magic Kingdom, Hollywood Studios, and Disney Springs, um, I probably have duplicates of these, but I'm gonna go through all my little knickknacks, paddywhacks, give a dog a bone, eventually, one day over the rainbow, <laughs> and sort through everything, so, you know. When you check in, you get a card if you don't have a magic band. And I have these. Now the reason I have two, I have a Frozone and a Pluto, um, is because basically we met up with our friend Victoria and long story short, it's all in the vlogs. I'll put this link in the description, as I said, to Adam's channel. But we met up with Victoria, we added her to our account <laughs> so we could like book rides and that together. And Victoria's account swallowed my account and deleted me from the system. So my magic band became defunct. So Disney gave me a voucher for another magic band. Um, and so I have two. So yeah, they gave me this until I found another magic band. Anyway, so my two magic bands uh, I got. Um, I bought this one, which is a Be Our Guest. Um, I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if it will focus. It might. It says be our guest and it's got little cakes. And then on this side it has Oh, 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 oh. I think it's because of my face. Hi, that mug. I mean, you get the idea. You know what he looks like. <laughs> That's that. Thanks, camera. And then this one was the one I got the voucher for, which was a limited um balloon one now oh yeah that's it so i really like that i took this little twiddly thing off because it was aggravating me um hey because it's in focus now let's show you lumiere ah oh, look at that adam and i stayed at beach club which has the fabulous storm along bay pool which has got a sandy bottom oh and it also has water shoots lazy river and one day Adam went to Universal and I had a day of just walking around Magic Kingdom taking pictures of Little Mickey. We'll get to Little Mickey in a minute. Uh, but in the afternoon I had a little go of Storm Along Bay and I got this, this little uh, thing to say that I was allowed to go in there because it's for um, Yacht Club and Beach Club people. But nice little keepsake. I bought these ears in animal, I think it was Animal Kingdom, but you can get them in most places. I did see them in Hollywood Studios. Um, I really like these so much. I think they were like $25 or something, and they're so soft, and they just look really cool on. Ta-da! 
but um, there's many pictures of me wearing these, so... Um, <laughs> Because my day in Magic Kingdom on my own, I wore them, and then in the video day in Magic Kingdom, I wore them. So, yeah, there's lots of pictures of me in these. Um, if you want to follow my Instagram, it is C. Check it out. So that's that. I also bought a hat um, because... No, this I bought in Animal Kingdom, but you can buy it pretty much everywhere. Because my actual white hat that I bought for like £4.99, just to protect my um, head and everything, it was a cheap one. And it lost its shape, and it was very thin, and it didn't suit me. So now I have this Nike one with Mickey on, and this is really good quality. Um, I think it was $30, but it is definitely worth it. It's strong, and I think this is going to really last. Do we talk about Little Mickey now? I think it's time. Hello. <laughs> this is Little Mickey. He is a Nuimo. Nuimo are a series of stuff by Disney that came out a couple of years ago, a few years ago maybe even, and they're little toys with magnetic hands, there, 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 magnetic hands and poseable bodies so that you can like make them do stuff, that sounds wrong, and little clothes. And the clothes range from, I don't know, 9 99 and up to like 21 99 for the outfits. And um, like this spirit jersey he's wearing right now, this Walt Disney World spirit jersey would have been like twenty dollars, twenty pound, um, which is a lot of money. But <laughs> so, where to begin? So I bought this. I bought him for like four pound, just under four pound, in the sale in Shop Disney, their big store in Oxford Street. When I was with my friend Brogan, I'll put a link to that video. Um, so we went to a Hocus Pocus event, Brogan invited me along, and we went into the big Disney store, the only Disney store that's pretty much left in the UK, and I saw him and I was like, do you know what, I've always wanted one, and to like pose with pictures for him and everything, and be like, ooh, little Mickey, and then I was like, do you know what, I'm just going to get him, he's £4, whatever, got him a little pride outfit, I will put the picture here that started it all, <laughs> uh, the pride outfit was like 9 99 I think that had been reduced, and that was it. Took a few pictures around London with Brogan and that was all I thought it was. Then I decided I'm going to take him in his pride outfit to Disney World. Going around taking pictures, he becomes the bane of my friend Adam's life. Because though I have reduced down the amount of pictures using a disposable digital camera app, because I usually take thousands and thousands, this became my new thing that I latched onto for my anxiety and stuff. Anyway, this has been a very long story but... This is the origin story. We went to the outlets, the Disney outlet thing, and um, they had the outfits for $1.99 each. And I bought 12 outfits. Now the whole 12 outfits are not in here because I gave four or five outfits away to a viewer. Hi Rachel, on my day in Magic Kingdom, I was uh, she got, she saw me and we stood and watched the parade together and she said that she had a little stitch and I said to her, how many outfits does little stitch have? And she said, one. And I said, hey, you could have little Mickey's outfits because now that I photographed him in them around Magic Kingdom, you can have them. So I took the shirt off his back and she had them. So I don't have all of the outfits, but I do have most of them, including his Halloween, um, Halloween outfit, which for the Halloween party, which has like skeletons on and this furry jacket, which made him look very much like Harry Styles. So in the video I say, he's dressed as Harry Styles. Anyway, this is probably very boring to all of you and very amusing to me. So all these clothes are actually gonna go to my niece and nephew because when I was away, I went on the Shop Disney UK website and I ordered them their own little Mickey and little Minnie. So, they are now Noah and Lois's. Um, the original little Mickey is staying with me because, and I'll keep a couple of outfits so that he has some clothes. I don't want him to be nude, but um, yeah, one of the spirit jerseys is gonna stay. I think it'd be the 50th one. Maybe even both of the spirit jerseys because they can be worn like daily. <laughs> Hello, it is future Gary here. The people of Instagram Live have spoken, and Little Mickey has his own Instagram. You can follow it here. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of the video. 
Speaking of Noah and Lois, here we go from Turning Red. Lois loves these dolls, these long dolls. So, Turning Red. I can't remember her name, sorry. Um, Goofy. Adam's souvenir cup um, from the trip. Mine is here. I got the yellow one. And now they've got these little things. Um, my souvenir cup from, this is for Lois, this frozen souvenir cup from Steakhouse 71. Um, yeah, they had all these cocktails and everything. I was like, what's in that cup? So, <laughs> so these are the cups they're getting. Um, Lois has got this mini headband thing. Lois has also got these three notebooks, these fabulous notebooks with different designs, mini, and it says love and love Disney and things like that. So that's that. And then Noah has these two pins. Um, these are the characters on parade pin, pin, yeah, yeah, pins. This is the Roger Rabbit and the Pinocchio. And they open out and they're very, very nice. I also got a Pinocchio because I didn't get it the first time when I saw them when they were released a few months ago. Um, and at the time I bought them, they were 19 99 and they were reduced to 9 99 So um, he will really like those because he collects pins. And they're really good quality, like great pins. And now for the grand finale. Is that an entire bag full of pins? It is. Disgrace, disgrace. Oh, but they look so good. <laughs> they look so good. Let's start with the resort pins because then I know where I'm at. So, my friend Adam and I, I don't know why I say that every time because you know who he is, but Adam and I, um, no, we stayed at the Grand Floridian for the Disney Wish series and this is the pin. I didn't actually get it at the time because it was just out of stock, la la la, the sun. But this is the Riviera where we stayed with Max and Alex. Lovely, lovely, before we went on the Disney Fantasy. And then this is the current series that's going out. Beach Club! How cool is that? Love it. This is Animal Kingdom Lodge. We didn't stay there, but Max and Alex actually did stay there a little while ago, but they didn't get the pin. They weren't collecting them then, so I bought this for them. So, Max and Alex, Alex and Max, your collection is complete. Let's do the cruise line ones. I wasn't going to collect these, these circle ones, but then I realised they're the things that are on the front of the ship. So I was like, uh, yeah. So I've got the magic one. I've got... Oh, 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 the drama, the drama, the drama. I've got the fantasy one. Now I just need the dream one because I don't do one of the wish. But yeah, they're really cute. A new castaway key one. Very cute, very cute. Stitch, because I love Stitch and this is him like in his little pirate clothes. Another fantasy one. These are the ones I originally collected. The ones with the characters on the back of the ships. And hopefully they do ones for the wish. Captain Mickey. Captain Minnie. I love that. And then this detective agency badge. Because we did the... Um, the little thing where you go around on the screens and solve the crimes and mysteries and um, I was like yeah do you know what I am gonna get the the badge to say that I completed the mission yeah and I know what you're thinking oh the mouse loves people like you <laughs> needs to get it needs to collect it I mean look around you do I need to show you the billion Funkos on the walls um no Let's do the sets. We have these two sets that are Pixar limited release and they are so cool. Very cute, love the ears. Now, can I see them from behind? So we have Barbie from Toy Story. We have Sully from Monsters Inc. That is Miguel from Coco. And then what's that? I can't see from behind. That is Anger from Inside Out. Then you have Remy from Ratatouille, 
Mrs. Incredible from The Incredibles. We have, I think that's Buzz from Buzz Lightyear. And then you have Russell from Up. Next up, we have the postcard and stamp pin. Oh, this was $21.99, but there's not much Tiana about. And because it's got Tiana and Naveen, and it's got new, a, a postcard from New Orleans. I really, really loved it. I saw these online, the new postcard and stamp pins, and I thought, if I don't get the Mickey and Pluto one, I'm getting that. So, I have it. I'm very, very pleased. These ones are just cute. Look at that. So, you have a Mickey waffle and a little bit of toast and bacon. And then you have watermelon, cherries and a lemon. Is that a lemon? Who knows? But I thought these were adorable. Okay, so we've got some miscellaneous ones that don't really fit in a category. Um, we have the Pinocchio, the characters on parade, Pinocchio. Harmonious, they now do a pin for Harmonious, which is great. Unfortunately, they don't do one for Enchantment, or at least it was nowhere to be seen. And I can't find it online, so I'm thinking they just do Harmonious. And then there's this Grogu one, which I just thought was so cute, because I am a Star Wars fan. Don't know if you can see that. Look how cute he is, his little face. But, talking of faces, many, many faces on these ones. So these are the supporting cast pins, and these are the ones that I've been trying to get for a while. The Hercules set and the Seven Dwarfs. Amazing. So, so good. It took me a while to find them, but they're in stock and I absolutely love them. The fact it's got the muses on as well. So good. Cannot get enough. So it is fall, autumn. I don't know why I went with fall first. Autumn in Disney World right now and in the world, Gary, in the world. And I got these Nightmare Before Christmas pins. Um, and some people may say, but they've got jangly bits, Gary. Yes, but they're also Nightmare Before Christmas. So I allowed it. That was the Christmas one. This is the Easter one. And then this is the Halloween one. And they open up to reveal characters. So there you go. I'll show you what's in the other ones, because I know someone in the comments might say, what's in the other ones? And then it's too late to show you, so. There you go. And there's Santa behind the Christmas one. So yeah, really, really cute. I had to get this autumn autumnal Miko for fall, because I absolutely love him. And we were also there during the 40th. Like, it is now the 40th anniversary of Epcot, so I got this lovely little pin of figment running amok, amok, amok. And then they do these. They do 11 country pins. I only got the UK. I was very tempted to buy them all, but they cost <laughs> $17.99 each. So I was like, no, I'll just get the UK. I'll stick with the UK. And my, my wallet was like, thank you. <laughs> As I said before, it is Halloween in Disney World. And I got these pins. The 2022 Halloween set. So I've got lots of characters on there. All from Winnie the Pooh. My faves. Now there are, how many are there in, in total? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's a castle one that I don't really like. So I didn't get it. See, I don't just get them all for the sake of it. Six seven and then the set eight. Four of these were given to me by a lovely viewer. Despite my protests, they very kindly gave them to me because I didn't know if I was going to get out there before they went out of stock and stuff like that. So I won't say your name, but thank you very much. You know who you are. Um, so I bought two and I was given four of the six out of the seven of the little ones. It all makes sense. <laughs> So, we have Pluto, Goofy, that's a good one, Mickey, they're all good. I love Mickey in his pumpkin outfit, still a pumpkin, Minnie, 
Oh, Chip and Dale. And then by no means least, Donald! And a little ghost. I love the little ghost that comes with him. That's it. That, that's the pins. But it doesn't end there. <laughs> I thought, oh, I, I, I'll finish on the pins. But I didn't realise there was more things sort of scattered around. I have this shirt that I can't get off the hanger. So, it is a Marvel shirt. I never buy myself clothes because I'm not really a clothes person. Um, I just like my t-shirt and that's it. But I bought this shirt. It's a size large and I usually like an extra large because I like everything bigger on me um, I just like to hide in amongst my clothes um, but I am actually a size large so this is a large it does fit me um, it doesn't fit me snugly actually it fits me just right um, and it's got it's from the pride range and it was in the outlets for $14.99 and what I didn't realize is is that on the inside I don't know if you can see that it has the the pride the Marvel pride words it says bold Heroic, strong, protect, power. What does it have one at the top? It does. It says courage. And it's really, really nice. Let's finish now on Mickey Plush. Now, I know what you're thinking. Some of you will know from my Instagram lives. Didn't you say you're not getting Mickey Plush anymore because you can't keep up with it and... Well... He's dressed in a pumpkin outfit. What can I say? I had to get it this year. Has he got something on his little feet? No, because this is the Disney Parks one. But you can get him in Shop Disney UK. And I just had to get him. When I saw him, I think I even had a picture with him. Um, I'll put it here. When I bought him. He's so cute. I don't really want to put him away after Halloween. I want to just keep him out because he's so cute. Um, but yeah. All the pumpkin Mickey. And then the elusive... 50th anniversary Mickey. I have wanted this since the beginning of the 50th anniversary and every time friends have been or we, I've been with my friend Adam, him and Minnie have been out of stock but we went, we just got back, he was in stock, he was everywhere and I finally have him. I'm so pleased. But that sees, that sees the end of my haul. Um, as you can see I was very naughty and um, yeah won't be going for a while so <laughs> thank you for watching take care of yourselves give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and i will see you very very soon Mwah.